Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of the Game Feed. Today is going to be a really, really, really short episode. Uh, just the fact that I have shortly after this is uploaded, go straight to the hospital. But I promised I'd get something out today, and today I'm just going to go ahead and talk about one thing, one thing only. It should be short, maybe about five, ten minutes, um, and that's early access. And early access is um, basically a demo of sorts. You pay for it. Uh, you're paying for um, early access to a game that may or may not come out. And good examples are Daisy, H1Z1, um, Seven Days to Die, or I, th I believe that's what it's called, Elite and Dangerous, uh, stuff like that. And a lot of things get started uh, through Kickstarter, uh, Steam Greenlight, uh, Steam Early Access. Xbox now has it. Xbox One, they released um, preview for Lone Dark, I think it's Lone, yeah, it's Lone Dark, as well as Elite Dangerous, and I did get a lot of questions from some of my friends and asked me, it's like, is uh, early access titles worth it? Um, and I have two, two answers for it, actually, actually, and I'll go ahead and start with the positives. Um, the positives are, you do get to help, uh, you know, a developer come out with a game, uh, help them um, you know, tell them what's wrong with the game, help with the develop development as well as help fund it, um, as well as you get to test it out. You get to play the game, uh, see, you know, be see everything uh, as it comes out with new updates. Uh, Daisy's been doing it for a long time, still no final product yet. Um, and H1Z1, same thing. I, I, I play both of those games, uh, H1Z1 more than Daisy anymore, but. Um, it is worth doing if you want to support a title that you believe in. Um, now, like I said, there's um, so there's definitely some cons in this, and I'll go ahead and get to that. And um, that's what if the developer, you know, starts playing the game, and I think the game was uh, Hunting Grounds or something like that. It was a dinosaur game. It's a you hunt dinosaurs. It's a dinosaur survival game, and um, the developer basically uh, <laughs> was like, oh, this is going to be a great game. It got advertised. People liked it. And they basically said, we don't have time to fund it. We, and they walked away from it. And this has happened several times within Kickstarter. Uh, Kickstarter and early access titles. You can look up the history of it. But that's the thing you don't want to do. Now, um, say if you have the extra income and you're really interested in trying to game, best thing I would do is check out um, YouTube or gameplays of it, uh, watch people try it out, see if that's what you want. Um, or if you have friends that's tried it, ask them. Let them show you how to play it, show you how the games work, get as much information about them, the developer, uh, their history, and just make sure, because you don't want to go in blindly on this and buy this early access game only for a month later for it to get completely shut down and that's it. The game's basically useless. They shut down the servers, and that's it. You don't want that. That sucks, and, you know, nothing good comes out of it. Um, now, like I said, um, you're going to start seeing more and more of this. Now, that's, you know, um, early access is not particularly well thought of in the gaming community, and it somehow got it made its way to the Xbox One. I'm sure it's going to hit the PS4 if it hasn't already. I don't know yet. Um, but the only thing I can say is just be careful and just watch out for what you exactly... Uh, if you think it's a good investment, then go for it by all means. If you don't, don't do it. Just get as much information about it as possible. And hopefully, um, you know... If you do do it, um, the game comes out. It's it works. Um, it's awesome. But nine times, well, usually nine times out of ten, these games will come out the way they want. And they usually have super long uh, development times. And anymore, people like on Steam, they'll be shitting out um, tons of these early access games where they just take um, Unity assets, just plug them in, and say, "Oh, this is an early access survival game." And it's a dime a dozen for these things, uh, these Daisy Minecraft style games, and um, just be careful. There's a lot of people who's going to scam you. Um, there's be like, 
uh, this is an easy way to get the money um, and if something popular is out you know, people just want to capitalize on that and it's no different than mobile games and next episode we're going to talk about mobile games but I'm not going to get into that right now but um, I'm going to go ahead and end it at that and um, like I said hopefully Thursday I'll have a new episode of Let's Talk um, as you know like I said I've been going through a lot of stuff lately with um, I've not been able to sleep so I have to go see a do a sleep study and I'm I get to see a uh, weight loss surgeon so that's good uh, we're talking about getting to sleep and I've been on a bunch of different medications and like I said I have not been able to sleep and I'm completely restless and but like I said I did want to get something out today like I promised uh, every Tuesday Thursday and I also want to go ahead and apologize completely about my lack of streams if you follow me on twitch.tv forward slash pants six you notice I have a schedule up but I have not been following it just due to the fact that I've not had like I haven't felt felt too well I haven't felt like doing it and I do try my best to let you guys know on Twitter so uh, hopefully you guys understand and hopefully I can get some streams in going I, I don't know when uh, hopefully this week I'll get a couple but I do promise uh, a new episode of Let's Talk and hopefully a new episode of the Goblin Traders I did not get that out this weekend like I said just completely mess completely not feeling well so um, and that guys thanks for stopping by I hope uh, uh, my opinion on early access titles helps out and be sure to hit the like and subscribe button um, help this channel grow and be sure to share just tell everybody about the channel I definitely will appreciate it and um, yeah hopefully I feel better soon so I can get this solved uh, you know this game rolling and I do apologize as well as for the darkness <laughs> so guys thank you so much for stopping by and have a wonderful evening